had nowhere to stay years ago when we first come down here. Everybody used to sleep back here behind the library. And the parks people let us sleep there. And then when she got this great idea to build all this over here, they started cleaning up and packing everybody up, resting them, trespassing them. Down by the river over here, they built a big old fence to keep all the homeless out of there, too, from sleeping in that because they got plans for condos and Donald Trump's big uh, idea of whatever he was going to do here. And uh, that's why everything's fenced off and being built, and why the homeless don't have the places on the river no more. But, you know, it wasn't probably the cleanest thing they'd done with the homeless because they were dirty down there and, you know, broke the rules, but it was a place you could go to sleep and, right. you know, be safe. Mm -hmm. Now you out here, you never know who's going to walk up on you out here. Are you afraid of getting mugged, robbed, beat you know, up? I'm not, I don't have anything, but it sure would be bad to just get beat up or your arms or legs broke for no reason at all. You know, you never know what crazy fools running around out here. Like these teenage gangs. Yeah, they, they do stuff they, like that. I was in Daytona when they beat that uh, poor old man in the woods to death, the 15 to 16-year-old boys, the three of them. And they have the homeless bastions in Nashville, too. College kids do it at Vanderbilt. I think that was going on in, like, Fort Lauderdale, West Palm, yeah. too. It was on film. Yeah.